Hi, I'm Dr. Fred Hansen, and today I would like to speak with you about dealing with adolescence. One of the more common problems we hear is dealing with adolescence. It's a difficult time to be an adolescent. More mobility, more social media, more choices. In some ways, this can be wonderful. In other ways, it can be disastrous. One of the things we need to keep in mind is that the adolescent brain is not fully formed until perhaps as late as 22 to 24 years old. While they're extremely intelligent and look and sound fully adult, their ability to make positive choices is sometimes lacking the capacity they need to make those good decisions. I find it helpful to engage adolescents in dialogue. By doing so, I demonstrate respect for them rather than simply telling them what to do and how to do it. I try to query them in a manner that allows them to search for their own answers rather than those I could provide. Secondly, I ask them to give me several possible choices as to why they make or made certain decisions. This gives them the opportunity to examine their thinking and logic. Thirdly, when we discover they are becoming confrontational, allow a third party, preferably someone trained in adolescent behavior, to intervene. I find that generally there's a lot of emotion in a family in conflict. And the counselor can help lower that emotional level and help generate positive choices that all can live with. I had a parent once who had a four-year-old child who wanted to sit in his dad's lap when he ate. The child was very tall for his age. And because of that, the family felt it was stupid for him to want to sit in an adult's lap to eat. What they didn't realize is that at four, he was still a baby. He wanted the warmth and cuddling of his father. Genetics didn't make him wiser, just taller. Once the family understood what his level of emotional development was at that age, it helped them change their behavior, he became a much happier child. Adolescence is somewhat like that. Because they look, sound, and many times act like adults, it doesn't mean they are thinking that way. Our job is to assist in that development. Professional help may be quite simple. If you're struggling with an adolescent from arguments to the potential use of drugs, give us a call. Don't let this wonderful time of life with your child be destroyed. Many families stay estranged for a long period of time over events that might have been resolved with the aid of a professional. Thank you.